If you have already purchased your tickets for holiday travel, then you're in the clear. However, for those of you that usually wait until the last minute, you might run into more roadblocks than you think. The hustle and bustle of the holidays seems to be inevitable each year, especially if you plan to fly to your destinations. Valley International Airport is a constant hub for travelers flying in and out of the valley on a daily basis. But this holiday season, it will be more packed than usual. Uh, if you haven't reserved a seat yet, you need to do that right away because the seats are filling fast. Michael Browning, the director of aviation for the airport in Harlingen, says although spring break is a top contender for booked flights. The holidays still remains number one. We're actually seeing uh, more people earlier which is kind of an interesting twist. The Wall Street Journal recently reported a dramatic increase in sales this year for flights for the Christmas and New Year's Eve holidays. Those sales are already up more than 50 percent from just a year ago. Trends show that families will travel farther distances this holiday season and stay longer at their destinations. Maybe because they get a price break if they don't come back. Immediately after the holidays, uh, there are more seats to fill, so the airlines may give them a break. As you can see, this airplane behind me, it holds up to 122 people. It's actually one of the smaller planes that flies here through Valley International Airport. And during the holiday season, every single seat will be filled. However, if you have not booked your holiday flight just yet, Browning says not to worry. Although there will be a shortage in seats and chances might be slim, there is still a possibility in squeezing your way into one of the flights. You can try to book your flight right now. Um, you're probably going to pay a little bit more than you would have, you know, two or three weeks ago. Browning believes it's safer for travelers to fly instead of drive during the holiday season due to increased amounts of drunk drivers that will be on the road. Reporting in the studio, Hannah Lynn, Action 4 News.